Well, there you go. <clears throat> There's the result. It is actually used more in a trap mode than in <laughs> gameplay. But there you go. In all it reels, Romeo done. So now every lamp works now. So this machine is done. Unfortunately, despite having in a lit reel bands, they don't like. I tried that reel deck on the back, and no, they don't like. Neither does that one. Yet the fourth reel on both machines does the fourth reel on that and the fourth reel on this, both in a lit. So they've obviously sacrificed the three main reels for the fourth reel. That's my only guess, except for this one where they all like, all of them like. I know it seems like I'm being a bit of a pain. Um, someone suggested turning the flow lamp off you can't really on this one because in gameplay that it just goes too dark and plus it lights these on the two at home though i might try that i might try that so yeah in a lit reels done as you can see and it uses them in the traps as you can see it flashing about but obviously the like the flow lamp under there sort of kills them bottom ones really but but it is what it is Oh yeah, of course then. I've got two peas in this. Really, it doesn't pay out two peas. See? Nice, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> I know it's a silly old nonsense. I don't care. There's no point putting two peas in this machine. That's that's why they was all on the top. Because there's no tube from. Because it doesn't pay out any four p wins. So. Anyway, that's better, isn't it? To me, it's a massive improvement. Although it's, I, I get it's simple. I, uh, I don't know. I don't know where it is. And yeah, I've had the, I had the reels out yes, so I'm, I'm going to go for it. But I've, don't, I've no idea where it is. <laughs> that was pure fluke. I could have gone up and I wouldn't have got it. <laughs> I'm pleased I'm actually a bit tickled with that. It's nice to pick the right way, especially when you're doing a video. I know it's one below the star, but I know, I know. But with 130 machines, I can't know the real combinations. And I've got the lamps in a perfect position now, it's in and out a couple of times. So it's nice it because it was a little bit down and it was a little bit up. So I'll try and do it right. And as you can see, perfect. My efforts are worth it. Because <laughs> I spent a good few hours last night messing about with them. Because one of them was being a pain in the ass. That one, that light there, was being a pain in the ass. I had to have the plug out the back and push the wiring loom and the pin back in and all that. Ah. <sighs> 
<coughs> there's some of you now, there's no holds on this, so there's no play rooms. A little chin would be nice for that 160, wouldn't it? There you go, and then, and that's it. Mr. P's is 240. Is that in the same position as it was before? I don't know if it was really. Uh, have we got anything? Do, 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 do. No. to believe really that this was a plus money in it. <laughs> yeah, one shot. Yeah, it's hard to believe that this this machine was that machine. Yeah, hard to believe I know. now when it does the sort of noise for the letters you know and it lights up it gives it reason doesn't it it sort of gives it a reason I don't like it anyway I think it's improved the machine a hundred percent I mean, I realise that these are not the most exciting machines to play. I get that, but <clears throat> for a lot of us, me certainly, these were these were everywhere and. Loved them, loved them. Back in the late 80s, simple fun. 
nothing complicated about these. I, did, I didn't know the real orders. I, I know some people did, and some people used to try and muscle up and go, oh, I know the real orders and all that crap. But I, I, don't, I didn't. But sometimes you just got lucky and went the right way, like I did on that jackpot. Only two for you go, seems. Even back then it didn't seem a lot, did it? I mean, what are these, 1987, 88, I guess? 89, maybe? And there were certainly lots of these about in the 90s. And the MPU4 version of this. And I guess I like the idea that you could nudge up and down, you could do, you could do both. And not just one way or the other. That's where you had to really know your reels, weren't it? And the sounds. <laughs> what can you say? Stop in a door. Another one done. Arcade ready on new coins. I think. <laughs> yes, no. It is on new coins. And a nice little swap this was. And the guy's gone on to get Monte Carlo to go with the snakes and ladders, so he's got both. He's got a nice little set there. Maybe when I'm next over Oxford, I can go and record it. The Monte Carlo one. For my channel, maybe. When I next go to Collins. <laughs> All these little things that you notice. MPU free no jump in it. Love it. One, two, three. No syringes, unless we're forty p. If it's there, I'll have a look. One, two, three, four, five. Nice and steady, Eddie. 2p? 2p or not 2p? I'm, I'm pretty sure this doesn't give random nudges, that it just doesn't. I don't know, I could be wrong, but I can't remember this one. Just suddenly giving nudges out of the blue, I think you have to have the N. NG, NDG, NDE, or whatever it is. Yeah, NDE.
I can't imagine people who want a massive long video of this one, but a bit more. Pernickety on these ten pieces. This machine is. I sort of try and find the ones that. Taking that two quid back <laughs> and some. Well, it's still relatively cheap playing it. Do, do, do. 
Likes the correct ones as well, which is quite cool. Because some of them don't. So at some point, <laughs> so that kind of keeps you going, money in it.
that will smash it. <laughs> Yeah. Kind of come full circle, really. MDM Topany Nadjar, the MPS one, because I'm pretty sure they did an MPU4 version as well. <laughs> 